Hello everyone, my name is Jayatma Vikramanayaka and I am the United Nations Secretary General's Envoy on Youth. First of all, let me thank the International Fund for Agricultural Development for this opportunity to send you this video message. Welcome to the Youth Agropastoral Entrepreneurship Summit. The following days will be full of inspiring and engaging events and I hope you will take every opportunity to share your knowledge and vision, to learn from each other, from the fantastic guests and to inspire others beyond this summit. As you may know, our world is currently home to the largest population of young people in the history of our planet. There are 1.8 billion of us worldwide. 88% of this young population currently live in the rural areas of developing countries. This number is often perceived as a challenge for development, a problem that needs fixing. But I don't see it that way. What I see is 1.8 billion agents of change. 1.8 billion reasons for hope that by 2030 we will achieve sustainable development goals. This is a huge reason to ensure that you get a seat at the table and meaningfully participate to resolve the problems that our world is facing. Food and nutrition are a primary example of this. By 2050, in fact, the world population will reach an approximate total of 9 billion. Feeding 9 billion people will require a 70% increase of food production if we aim at achieving SDG 2 on food security. This is not easy, particularly considering other issues such as the increasing impact of climate change, which is already affecting the agropastoral sector. If we want to succeed in the fight against hunger and really leave no one behind, the role young people play is crucial. You are the most vital and dynamic workforce. You are inherent innovators and open to try new technologies and methods. It's imperative that we tap into this dynamism and unlock your potential to increase food production and reach sustainable development. How do we do that? Firstly, we must join forces to ensure that development reaches rural areas and everyone has equal access to land, social services, health, education, markets and financing options. This will also help reduce the challenges of migration and urbanization. Secondly, we must invest in the skills development of young agropastoral entrepreneurs. Ensure that they have the necessary training, capacity building and access to knowledge and finance. Thirdly, and quite crucially, we must ensure that young people have access to decision-making tables. By supporting the voices of young people and ensuring their participation and leadership in policy making, we will draw out their enormous potential for positive change. These steps will be the key to achieve food security by 2030 and beyond. I commend you for all the work you are doing to ensure that our shared vision becomes a reality. And I look forward to all the positive change we are yet to see as young people work to make a world free of poverty and hunger a reality.